some anglers shock their audience when they go shooting a line, but Colonel Hammond Davis keeps his shocks for the fish. Helped by Edgar Robinson, an engineer, he's designed an electrical fishing machine which lures the poor fish into a net. Chains seem ambitious unless you're fishing for sharks, but through these passes the electric current. It's generated by this dynamo whenever they can get it to start, just enough current to tickle the fish's fancy without fusing their lights. The object of all this activity is not to angle for fish, but to rid the valuable trout stream at Hambridge of coarser varieties. It's done under the supervision of a century-old angling society. Would-be poachers, please note. As current passes through the water from one pole to the other, fish are attracted into the net. Rod, pole or perch, what's it matter if you're allergic to tables? Reason enough for any fish to feel cut up. As the boat moves on, the nets await, and the fish feel discomfort in their spine. Only in the net can they find positive relief, but it's a negative outlook just the same. The circuit is broken as the net comes out, but it's too late for the fish to switch. All he can hope for is a transfer to other waters, where the anglers specialize in perch. 